So before starting this video guys let me tell you is that to know the latest technology news and tips and tricks just go to the www.bobison.tech So here you will find all the latest technology news and top 10 gadget list and the reviews of the latest technology devices and even the tips and tricks and the future tech and gaming and science videos. So just go to the www.bavishan.tech, a place where technology meets you. So let's start this video. Hey what's up guys, myself Sopin Srivastava and welcome back to your YouTube channel. So guys we are living in the world which is transforming very fast. Just few years ago we were needed a room sized computer to run the simple operating systems like Windows 98 and now we can run those operating systems in the device which can fit in the palm of our hand and now in this video I am going to show you how far we all can. So previously I have shown you how to run the Windows operating system on the Android phone including the Windows 10, Windows 7, Windows XP and even the Linux operating system like the Ubuntu, Kali Linux and even the Android operating system but there is one operating system that we had not able to talk about and that operating system is the Apple's Mac OS and in this video I am going to show you how to run the Apple's Mac OS X on any Android phone. So let's go to our smartphone and see how we can run it. So here we can see guys I am on my smartphone. So first of all you need to download some files. So to download this file you need to go to the description and there you will find a link to this website which is called www.babison.tech. Here you can see. So this is the website where you need to go and here you need to download some files. Uh, the files here is the Limbo Power PC emulator and after that the Mac OS file. Here you can see this is the link of the Mac OS file and above you will find the link of the Limbo Power PC emulator. So here we will not need to use the Limbo emulator, the normal version of Limbo emulator. Here we will need the Limbo Power PC emulator which is the different version of the Limbo emulator and it will help us to boot the Mac OS on the Android phone. So first of all you need to go to the Google and there you have to search the your smartphone processor architecture. So for example you need to download Limbo PC emulator but Limbo Power PC emulator is available in different uh, format for different devices like for the x86 divided for my smartphone which is the intel processor which has the intel processor i need to download this version okay but if you have the device which, uh, with the arm v7 processor or arm v8 you need to select the right option of the limbo power pc meter for your smartphone so first of all you need to go to the google and search there for your smartphone processor architecture okay and after that just download the right version of the limbo power pc meter from here and after that just slide down and go to this link where you will find a mac os file so just download that mac os file so after the download will complete you will get this mac os file which is this mac os dot qcow2 and its size is 1.26 gb so just download this file and after that just place it in your smartphone storage and just remember the location of this file okay now you need to go back and after that you need to download the limbo power pc meter and install it so when the download and install process of will be completed open the limbo power pc meter and here you need to click on this option and here you need to click on this new and here you need to create a new virtual machine so just give here any virtual machine name so i will give here mac os x okay and click on the create after that you need to click here and go to the user interface and select the stl option so, so select the stl in the user interface in the orientation just left it as the auto and keyboard layout should be the english and here we have to select the in full screen and the in, in the architecture option just select here and select the ppc okay which is the power pc and in the machine type just select here and select the mac 99 and in the cpu model just leave it as the default option and in the cpu course only select the one course okay just keep this point in mind you need to only select the one course and after that just go to the ram memory and here you need to select the appropriate amount of the ram that your smartphone can give for example for my smartphone i have the 4 gb of ram so i can choose the uh, the maximum amount of ram that i can give which is the 1016 mb but if the limbo pc uh, limbo power pc limiter crashes when you click on the play button after setting up the whole setting uh, if it crashes you need to just reduce the amount of ram you given here okay and after that just go to the hard disk option and click on this and click on the open and here you need to go to the location where you put the mac os file which you downloaded from the my website which is the www.babison.tech 
so just download that file and just go to that location where you put it that file and select it now slide down and you have to leave all the setting as default don't change it here the VJ display will be the STD which is the standard display model and in the sound card just select the none in the network uh, card just select the user and in the boot from device select the hard disk here it is and in the high priority so it will be firstly will not checked here so just click on that and check and click on the ok button ok now you need to slide down and if you have any option to uh, clean up your RAM memory just click select that it will help your power, uh, limbo emulator to uh, run the Mac OS faster ok so you can see now I have the 2 GB of RAM free so when I will click on the play button it will boot the Mac OS faster ok so first of all make sure that you checked everything correctly that you have selected your STL so first of all check everything and after that uh, you need to click on the play button so I will click here the play button ok now you can see I will click on here on the play button so it will start the booting of the Mac OS let me focus on it ok so you can see so it's booting the Mac OS so it will take some time it just depend on your smartphone specification so in my smartphone it takes almost uh, from 15 minutes to 17 minutes ok it will not take uh, much more than that uh, while booting the windows operating system on the android phone I have seen that it taken a lot of the time but in the mac OS it taken almost uh, the maximum amount of time it taken for my smartphone is the 15 minute only ok so it's acceptable because this device is not designed to run the mac OS and mac OS is not designed to run it on the android operating system ok but it's became possible because of the limbo for pc emulator so here you can see it's booting right now so let me back when this step will be complete so here you can see guys it's booting up the mac os and it will taking some time to load so it will take almost uh, 5 minutes to 10 minutes here so you need to wait here uh, here you can see almost it is booted ok so these two these three files is uh, the files which I uh, pasted in this mac os you can easily do it you, if you want to copy and paste any file or any software in this mac os you can simply do that by using the shared folder option which you guys normally did not notice in the demo PC meter but you will find the shared folder option in which you can copy and paste any file which will be open in the virtual machine which you want to open ok for example if you want to uh, open an image file in this virtual machine so just go to the limbo emulator folder uh, in the in the internal storage you will find the folder which is named uh, with the name of the limbo and in that folder you will find the name of the folder uh, shared folder so you need to select that shared folder and open it and there you need to copy and paste all those files that you want to use in the virtual machine that you want ok for example in this virtual machine I wanted to copy and paste these three uh, files so I just copied and passed it in the shared folder and from there I just open it uh, and copy it past here so when you select any file in the shared folder it will be so shown here just like the uh, disk option shown here which is named uh, untitled so when you select any shared folder option so there will also another uh, disk file just below of this uh, disk file which will contain all those files which present in the shared folder ok ok now let's go to uh, some option here so let me go to the let me open this untitled which is the disk which is the uh, home file folder of this my quest double click on this you can see it's opening up and let me go to the application and see uh, what are the application which comes preloaded in this mac os here you can see it will open something like this 
so it lit it is little bit slow but it is acceptable because you are running it on the android phone not on any macbook or imac so this is only for those who wanted to experience how the mac os feels how it it is work and for the person like me which has never used the macbook pro or macbook or imac or any other apple product like this i just simply filled how the mac os run and i just using it on my android phone so it will help all those people who do not have any uh, laptop or any macbook or any uh, imac so you can easily use it on your android phone and feel how the mac os run and let me go to the application here you can see this is the application folder here and let it open so it will show the, uh, the number of application comes preloaded in this mac os so you can see it is the address book and the apple script calculator chess clock uh, let me open the clock so it is pretty cool app here you can see i just click on the clock and it is opening here right now so it's working similarly is in the same way it is run on the any uh, apple product like the macbook or imac okay so here you can see this is the clock app and what is normally do it will show the time with the second key uh, and also present here here you can see so it will look pretty cool on your android phone okay okay let me first of all close this one okay uh, and here we also find the finder and the i message and the photos email and the setting of the mac os uh, let me minimize it so you will find a lot of the options so just boot it up and play with the setting and have fun guys and if you want to add any file in this uh, mac os as i told you earlier you need to go to the shared folder option and for there uh, from there you need to just copy and paste that file in the shared folder in the limbo uh, limbo folder of the your uh, internal storage and just after that you will find any uh, another disk here and just click and open it and just copy and i'll uh, i'll paste all those file in the mac os okay so you can see everything working very fine okay guys so now it's time to end this video i hope you guys like it and if you have any questions just comment on will i will i will help you there and don't forget to go to our website which is the www.babison.tech there you will find the all the latest technology news and reviews and the tips tricks like this okay and just go there and you will also find the whole process uh, which i shown in this video step by step there as i already told you and all the download links will be present here so just go and download from there and thanks guys for watching my video have a good day and good luck and bye take care